Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to the GOAT channel. Pop this down just a little bit. Alright. So, today we're going to do a testing. Uh, back to the alcohol testing. I haven't done one in a while. Probably going to be the only one for a little bit. Because I think this might be the only bottle, new bottle I have. Had it a while. Hadn't opened it. As you can tell, still sealed off. This is Redneck Riviera Whiskey from John Rich, I believe, of Big and Rich fame. And so, this is 40% alcohol, 80 proof. So, we're going to do What's a Gut Rating, check it out. As you can see, proud partner of the Folds of Honor. A little reading on the back. Proud partner, Folds of Honor, portion of proceeds. Go to each bottle, be donated. So, that's cool. Donation. Let's flip this over. Read a little bit more about it. It's a full body, delicately smooth, perfect blend. Small batch whiskey, bright notes of vanilla, oak, caramel, touch of honey. 95% light whiskey aged two years. 5% American whiskey aged at least one year. So, let's pop this open. Take a look at it. See the color. Should have, you know, similar couple of what's in the bottle. But I still like to put it in the glass. And go from there. I haven't done one of these in a while, mainly because just hadn't had time. Um, I stay busy doing the cards, but this is one of my passions too. I, I'm, I'm big into like distilleries, breweries, uh, that kind of thing. Let's see if we can find a knife here. But yeah, I haven't done one. And then after this one, I don't think I have any unopened bottles left. Usually, the only reason I've opened the bottles I have is because of videos and then... I'll show you maybe at the end my little collection I have over here of bottles that are now open, but basically just partially drank out of. So, let's pop that. Smells pretty good. There's that. Just going to do about a half a thing. Eh, about a half a thing there. Turn that there. We got a lucky penny. Get it out of the way. All right. So this is kind of what you're looking at color-wise. You're obviously gonna have that, you know, caramel color to it. That's the way whiskeys use that light color. Now, smells good. Uh, doesn't really smell super aged, super oaky. really good flavor actually very impressed by this um so it's got that slight oak obviously it's gonna have that oak that's you know being aged two years and a year out of the five percent a year it's gonna have that oak flavor but it's got this nice little sweet flavor to it which i'm guessing is the uh, vanilla but nice smooth sweet flavor to it let's let's taste that again Sweet up front, oak flavor at the end, sweet aftertaste hangs in there. Actually, I enjoy this a lot. I'm I'm I don't know why I'm such a huge fan of this. I'm a very big fan of this one. Uh, the goat rating's probably gonna be pretty high on this one. I'm gonna take one more drink of it just to kind of gauge where we want to be at, but Very smooth. Not a lot of burn. A little bite. Just a little bite. Not much bite to it. Very smooth. Sweet taste up front. Oak hits you on the back end. I don't think I can go all the way to 9. I don't know. It's pretty close to a 9 for me on this one. I'm, I am actually a really big fan of this one. Um, let's just do this. What's the goat rating? Let's go 8.8. .8. Huge fan of this one. Um... It could trend into the nines, but I'm I'm gonna keep it keep it at eight point eight. 
I, I think I've had better. I don't know what I, the doors, I don't know what I put it at. It's a 12 year. And I think it's so far one of my favorites. Um, you know, whiskeys or bourbons or anything like that. I think it's one of my favorites, but I don't know. This one's ranked pretty high, so I'm going to go with 8.8. .8. And this is What's the Goat Channel, or What's the Goat Rating? Redneck Riviera Whiskey by John Rich. Thanks for watching. Goat out.